happy people i'm back with another video and today i have a project use it up video today this is going to be my christmas edition of my project use it up series i have a lot of winter scents um yeah so i didn't realize that i had this many winter scents in my collection you all know i just did that haul for the new christmas collection that bath and body works came out with if you all haven't seen that video check it out i'll go ahead and link it in the description but yeah i was going through my collection trying to see what old products i wanted to get out and y'all i have a pretty decent amount of christmas stuff okay so let me show y'all oh all the items that i'm about to be trying to use up Oof. yeah look at all this y'all <laughs> okay so those are all the items i'm going to be talking about here in today's video so i'm not going to waste any time and i'm going to hop right on into this so i can show you all what i'm planning on using up this holiday season i'm just going to go ahead and pull and go okay so the first item i see here on top is winter candy apple um this is a really this is actually one of my all-time favorite christmas scents from bath and body works so this is a body lotion in winter candy apple it's a really good scent and i really enjoy it um and then i also have the shower gel to pair with it so i'm gonna be trying to get through this this holiday season um this was as you can see these are from two different collections this i actually got as a gift years ago and i was afraid to use it up because i really like the scent but i think it's time to go ahead and move it out my collection you guys so yeah winter candy apple is the first scent i'll be trying to get through um the next scent i have here is christmas cookies y'all this scent y'all already know this is good too um i have started using this actually both of these scents i have in rotation right now so you all saw my recent review on this if you haven't i'll leave that linked below too but yeah this scent is awesome um and i want to try to get through this set this holiday season i do need to go pick up backups of that because i do not have any and i need them that scent is great next item i have here is frosted uh coconut snowball so I have this in the mini fine fragrance mist. So I'm going to try to get through that this holiday season. I also have a snowy citrus swirl. Um, this is a really nice, um, pretty much orange, orange creamsicle type of scent. Um, if you all ever had those lifesavers in the orange flavor, that's exactly what this smells like. And it smells really, really good. What I like about this scent is actually something that you can use year round. So if I don't get around to using it this Christmas, I'm not going to be too upset because it's really something you can use any time of the year. The next scent I have here. Okay, so y'all, I have a backstory on this. So this is a scent that they actually brought back last year. I was super excited about and I have a backstory on this scent, so I'm gonna get to it because y'all y'all know that if y'all know me and been watching my channel, y'all know what scent this is. It's my all time favorite Christmas scent from Bath and Body Works. Coconut Mint Drop, y'all. So this is back in my collection, okay? I'm super excited about it. When I say I got backups on backups on backups of this, I hauled it during the last um, Winter SAS, and yeah, I have tons of it now. I'm super excited to have it back in my collection, and I'm super excited to crack it open this holiday season, y'all. I absolutely love this scent. The scent is great. The lotion is hydrating, the shower gel, beast mode and then i this is my first time actually having it in the fine fragrance mist so i'm going to be excited to use this i'm going to be smelling i'm going to be walking around smelling like a sweet mint okay so backstory on this so i did haul this like i said during the last winter sas sale and i and i filmed my haul video and i thought that i deleted it and i actually just discovered that i still have the haul video so i am planning on releasing that video um soon what i probably will end up doing because i want to get off some more videos of these items that i'm going to be using up in this video so i'm going to probably release those videos during this winter's sas so i think winter sas um, comes up right after christmas so you'll probably see those videos come out um like i said it's from the last year's winter sas but it's going to give you all a great idea of some sense that you can shop during the sale so be on the lookout for that video is like i said it's going to be released probably after christmas time but it's going to show me hauling these items you guys and i actually have two of those videos i found both of them and i was super excited about it so that's just a little backstory on coconut man drop but y'all know i love this scent and so y'all gonna be seeing more of it okay here on my channel because this bad boy is beast mode i also have snowy peach berry in the mini fine fragrance mist i haven't used this scent before but i'm gonna be excited to give it a try i I also have it in the body cream so i plan to pair those two 
pair these two together whenever I do use it. And I love this packaging. It is so, so cute. Um, let me get a whiff of this. I don't even remember what it smells like. It smells like a fruity peach scent. So this is kind of like that snowy citrus squirrel swirl where you literally can use it any time of the year. So you don't really have to just use it during Christmas time. So if I don't get around to using it this holiday season, I'm not going to be mad. Next scent I have here is hot cocoa and cream. So I have it in the body lotion as well as oops as well as in the shower gel so i'm going to be super excited to use this i've actually not used this scent oops i've actually not used this scent before um and as you can see i got it during different you know sas sales or whatnot y'all this holiday season i am really trying to smell like an edible treat like i just i'm all about the gourmand yummy smelling scents so um yeah the hot cocoa and cream i'm definitely going to try to pull this out and use it this holiday season so i have this next i have christmas cocoa and mint this is in the body cream i actually have a few of these so i really want to crack this open and get through this because i really don't want it to go bad in my collection because like i said i have a ton of it actually this would probably pair really well with coconut mint drops so i actually did a comparison video on my channel comparing these two scents because i was looking for a dupe because they wasn't trying to bring back my lovely coconut mint drop for a while there so um i'll link that video below too if you all want to see these two um scents compared side by side but likely what i'll do is just to try to get through this i might just have the coconut mint drop shower gel use this um body cream and then just maybe just the coconut mint drop fine fragrance mist just on some trying to get this out of my collection but we'll see because i am in no hurry to use any of my coconut mint drop because i love that scent so much the next thing i have here is raspberry sugar so i have this um this is also another scent that's sweet and fruity and can be used year round so hopefully i get to using it this holiday season um the next one i have here is fresh sparkling snow this is a shower gel i don't think i'm gonna have any issue getting through this um yeah it smells really good nice and fresh yeah it just smells like a fresh christmas day so yeah i'll be excited to pull this out and get some use out of this next i have snowy morning so um this was a, a product that i featured in my forgotten haul because i had so many products y'all i forgot that i even had this and this mug has a mishmack lid i'm not really sure why or how but it's here and i think i've used this scent before and i liked it so i'm gonna try to get through this as well i'm thinking for this particular scent i'll probably just use it as a room freshener um because i feel like it's a scent that i kind of like walking into let me see yeah it's yeah it's a scent you want to walk into although it would be um, i don't know no, I like this on my body. So I'm going to try to use this either as a room spray or on my body just to try to get through it and get it out my collection. I do have a mini set that I want to get through as well. Um, this is one that I will use if I happen to travel this holiday season. I'm not sure that I will, but I have the Twisted Peppermint mini set. So I have the shower gel here, which is super cute. I have the um, body lotion and then I also have it in the fine fragrance mist. I do really enjoy Twisted Peppermint. So far I've only used it in the fine fragrance mist but it's such a nice refreshing and energizing scent like absolutely love it and then right now I'm using um, in my room in my essential oil diffuser I'm using a peppermint essential oil and it smells so good and like like rejuvenating so I'll be excited to use this on my body and then also when I use this scent I am going to pair it with my aromatherapy essential oil from Bath and Body Works so I'm going to be using all of these scents together and as a nice set I have used one of these already and it performs so well as a body oil like I like this stuff so much and so this is the scent I'm going to try to use whenever I I do pull out my twisted peppermint so this would be how i get through this particular set next i have let's see i have a, a mini winter candy apple i forgot to mention that so if i travel i will try to bring this in my luggage as well i have a thousand wishes so this scent i did use up in a fine fragrance mist and i really enjoyed it a lot i was so sad i didn't get a chance to review that product when i was using it um it was last year and y'all yeah, know how last year was it was crazy i really wasn't uploading that much but i really enjoyed this scent so i'm definitely going to make sure i do a review of this body lotion but a thousand wishes that's a lovely scent the next item i have here is a scent y'all i don't know how i'm gonna get this out of my collection because i'm not a fan of the scent but it is vanilla bean noel um y'all can see how long i've had it in here i know it's the vanilla note in here that's making it turn brown but i know it's still going to perform well because one of my older coconut mint drop uh lotions did that and it still was it still performed just like it was supposed to but with this scent um i just i'm not feeling it y'all like 
What do y'all think about Vanilla Bean Noel? Maybe I just need to try to give it another chance, but I know when I was using it um, last year, I just kind of got over it. And so somehow, some way, some shape or form, I will try to get this, get through this and get it out of my collection. I'm likely probably going to break it up into a bubble bath. Maybe I can get it out that way because that's how I was able to use the body cream. But if y'all have any suggestions for this, let me know because I'm just not feeling it. Like it doesn't smell bad, but it's not the vanilla bean noel that everybody i feel like was hyping up years ago i just feel like it smells like a plasticky vanilla scent and i don't really want to be walking around smelling like that so i have this i'm gonna try to use it up wish me luck just a few more miscellaneous items here i do have a bath and body works exfoliating foot mask uh foot mask with peppermint oil so i want to try to get through that this is similar to baby foot um so hopefully it'll leave my skin feeling nice and smooth and fresh um i do have two candles that i want to get through so i do have vanilla bean noel in a candle i don't know i went crazy one year buying all of it and ended up not even liking it i do have a feeling i'm going to enjoy it as a candle um but i just don't like it so much as body care so that's vanilla bean noel and then i also have um Frosted Cranberry, you guys, this scent is absolutely amazing. I'm super excited to use this this holiday season. I've used it in a wallflower before and it performs so well. It smells so good. This is probably what I'll be burning like the week of Christmas leading up to Christmas Day. I just have a few more tiny items here that I want to get through. I do have a few wallflowers. I feel like I haven't really been using my Bath and Body Work wallflowers uh, much lately. I've kind of transitioned over to using like the Airwick and the Glade plugins, but um, I still have my, my wallflowers and uh, the scent refill. So I'll go ahead and use what I have, but I have Tis the Season which I really love this scent. This is uh, one of my favorite candles to burn during the holidays. Um, but I don't have any candle form this year. So I'm gonna do frosted cranberry in the candle form and just do this as the wallflower. I also have winter candy apple. So I'll be excited to be walking into this scent. I also have a concentrated room spray, which is in flannel. And y'all, flannel smells like a nice, um, a nice sexy man in a plaid shirt, to be honest with you. So yeah, that's flannel kind of cool it kind of matches my nails okay y'all but yeah flannel is really good i enjoy this a lot but flannel is really good from the whiff of it that i got so i have no doubt that it's going to fill up a room and have it smelling really good so i have flannel that i want to get through i also have frosted cranberry and the um foaming hand sanitizer so i actually really like the foaming hand sanitizers from bath and body works i don't think they carry them anymore but um i'm going to use through the last few that i have so I'll be going through that. I do have some clay masks. I don't know if I'm actually going to get around to using these or not, but I want to put them in this project so I can try to get through them. Um, so these are some clay masks from Bath and Body Works. They have like ones that are good for different things. Um, I used two from this pack already, so I just have a few more left. And they're still good though. They haven't like solidified or anything like that. And then the last two items are wax melts. So I have a lot of candle i have a lot of wax melt warmers but i, I don't really burn them too much so i want to try to pull them out this year and use them so i do have winter from bath and body works um and let me smell this here i don't know that i know what this smells like Ooh, okay it smells good it smells like a masculine winter scent like a masculine a masculine winter scent so that smells nice so i'll be trying to get through winter and then the last one i have here is my favorite tis the season and i have it in the wax melt so again i don't have it in the candle form this year but since i have it in other forms i still get my fair share of it so yeah tis the season is so good y'all mm. it smells so good burning this during christmas last year Low-key, I'll probably still burn this during Christmas time this year. Maybe I'll do Frosted Cranberry like right now during the month and do the Tis the Season um, Wallflower and Wax Melt closer to Christmas because it just smells like Christmas Day, really, though. Okay, so I think that is everything, you guys. That is my Bath & Body Works Christmas project. Use it up. Let me know what you all think about this project. Do y'all, how many items y'all think I can get through? Let's see. Like, I'm thinking I can get through maybe eight or nine of these items, which is a pretty hefty goal, but it's what I would like to try and get through. But I think I can do it though. 
What y'all think? Y'all got faith in me? Let's do this. So yeah, let me know. What are you all currently using right now? during the holiday season i love to know i do upload every tuesday thursday and saturday for the month of december i am doing four uploads a week if you all like what you saw here definitely stick around join the happy family i would love to have you and as always you guys leave some love in the comments down below and i'll see you in my next video i hope you all have a wonderful awesome spectacular day bye